created two color wheels here, one in acrylic and one in crayon. I wanted students to see the difference in media and compare and contrast the two different media with each other. So the difference is with acrylic, there's considerable more resources and expense and time and mess that go into creating a color wheel with acrylic versus a color wheel with crown, which is pretty inexpensive. And so you can see that the crown does quite nicely in representing the hues. Um, and so for our project, I want us to use crown to render our color relationships. We can spend more time during the semester learning how to uh, mix colors and acquire the, all the uh, resources that help make painting uh, a more pleasant experience. So one of the other things I wanted to talk about there are quite a few different color relationship variations. We're going to concentrate on the warm, cool aspect of colors. So you can see that there's clearly a difference between the warm and cool side, right? And so with warm colors, warm colors we tend to associate with things that are hot, like the sun or like a burn, like a stove top burner that turns red or and then with cool colors, we tend to associate that with like things that are cool, like the ocean or the sky. And the other um, aspect of that warm, cool relationship is that warm colors seem to ascend or to um, pop forward and cool colors uh, seem to uh, recede into the background.